The back and forth between the city of Albuquerque and a downtown strip club continues after the club's appeal was denied. The city is now ordering knockouts to close, but the club is claiming the city is in the wrong. News 13's Annalisa Pardo reports. While the city is once again ordering the downtown strip club knockouts to close down, the legal battles between the two may just be heating up. In January, the city ordered knockouts to close down after calling the business a hotspot for crime. It came after a December shooting committed by a 16-year-old patron of the club. To justify the closing, the city claimed ordinance violations, saying the club didn't have proper identification for its dancers as required by local law. The club filed an appeal claiming it did have those records, but yesterday the appeal was denied. It's an injustice. We were the crime victims. We weren't the criminals. Well, we're disappointed in the result of the hearing officer, and we intend to appeal it further. The club now has to shut down for 30 days. In a statement, Mayor Tim Keller said in part, everyone has to play by the rules, and we will enforce our regulations to hold drivers of crime accountable. But the club's attorney says... They're putting people out of work. Um, they're depriving legitimate business owners of, of business income. Um, it, it's just a real typical reaction on the part of the city. Everyone's to blame but them and the criminals. Claiming it's the city not playing by the rules, saying yesterday evening after the appeal got denied, police showed up to knockouts. Ordered the lights turned on, the music turned off, and ordered everyone to vacate the premises. In a statement, a city spokesperson said in part, initially the city believed the closure was effective immediately and talked with employees before getting told by legal the closure would be in 10 days. Still, Knockout's plans to sue the city over this incident and continues to appeal its closure. Now that's in addition to a suit the club already filed claiming failure to fulfill public records requests. Annalisa Sapardo, KRQE News 13. The state's regulation and licensing department also has a pending case against knockouts concerning their liquor license.